Hey guys, I wanted to show you guys something that um, I don't know what I should do with it. This is um, my old custom-made uh, dump trailer. Um, it's um, it's old. It's beat. <laughs> it's in rough condition. This is one of the first things that I actually made. <clears throat> Sorry about the rough voice. But I don't know if I should refurbish it and bring it to life or just trash it. And start something else. Um, what do you guys think? And uh, let me know in the uh, the comments what you think. But to give you a little bit more ammunition on the decision. Um, this at one time was gear driven. And you can see the uh, universal joint. And the big long screw that goes to the back. It doesn't work now. Nothing is uh, It's not hooked up. I don't know why I disconnected it. But it's not hooked up anymore. And the wires that go to the gear motor are right here, hanging out. Um, also, if you flip it over. Uh, this little 3D printed piece that I made here, it, it's broken. And there is a little, little ghetto rigged uh, joint right here. So... And also, you don't know if you can see it, but the little leaf spring mount, is it this side or the, I think it's the other side here. Well, <laughs> I don't want to try to pick it up, but the leaf spring mount is, you know, like I was saying while, before the camera went wacky, the leaf spring mount is broken right here. I mean, it's just bouncing around. So it needs some work. You know, <laughs> the wheels don't roll free. Um... It's got four different color. Well, I think it's just actually two different color wheels on there. But, yeah, they're just two different color wheels. But that's that's not a bad thing. I can, that's just a repaint problem. But, um, but yeah, that's the trailer. And, like I said, I don't know what I should do with it. I'm thinking, um, I don't know. <laughs> I'm thinking of actually getting rid of this dump bed. Because this dump bed, again, I made this. And it's been a good little dump bed, but it's, I don't know if it looks right on that trailer. And the trailer's kind of short, too. But originally now, give you a reason why the trailer is so short. Originally, you see the little trailer hitch here. I had two of these trailers that I made. And they were, um, they were dollied together. And that was kind of cool because the, this truck right here, back in its, um, uh, four by uh, six by four days it it pulled them so it, it was kind of a cool little setup and i wish i had videos of that but that's way back in the day when youtube was you know you you couldn't just do it with your phone and all that stuff like that but anyway that's the trailer again you can show you some of the problems it has like right now you can see that it doesn't the bed is not flat down here and uh, also, like I said, some of these parts were 3D printed on that printer when I first got it. And I've had that printer for a couple of years. So they're starting to just not meet the quality that I got now. Also, this little landing leg set up here is, is kind of silly. But again, that's not a big thing because I have a set of... Uh, Lasso landing legs that are automatic, so they could go. They could go there, and that's that's not a big deal. You know, they can go right there, and that's not a big deal. Sorry about the camera work. I'm trying to move fast here, but but that's it. Also, besides all the the holes in the uh, the chassis and in the frame, the frame doesn't look that bad. So I I don't know. I think the frame is a work is workable. There's a couple little things here, like this mess here, but I could do something with that. And this little uh, work this little work deck here. But again, I could do something with it. It actually might be a good place to hide to hide a tank for the hydraulics up under here. So, and again, I have somewhere, and I'm not going to go digging it out. They're hiding from me. But I have a old hydraulic pump. Ta-da, there it is, from an um, uh, old Magom hydraulic pump. And I think this would be fine for um, 
for doing this, you know, running this, uh, lifting up the bed. So that's, you know, so anyway, that's the trailer. That's my next project. You got, again, guys, tell me what you, how, what I should do with it. You know, give me some suggestions. Should I keep the, um, uh, the actual dump box or should I buy one? Uh, should I scrap the whole thing and throw it in the garbage and, and convert my, to me, a flatbed, the one that's sitting in the back there to a dump trailer, which I was thinking about doing anyway, because I don't use it that much. I actually use the longer, um, uh, um, uh, what is it? The, the old, um, Hercules hobby flatbed more than I use it to me a one. So I was thinking about converting that to a dump bed too. Um, or either a log trailer, but again, I don't do log trailers that much either, but yeah, let me know what's going on. And, um, uh, I can probably figure out something to do with it before I get to the next video. Talk to you soon.